Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'm going to start off using the MAC Pink Pot in the shade Soft Ochre as the eyeshadow base. And for the eyeshadow palette, I am using this new palette from Revolution, collaboration with Rachel. And this is a really nice, colorful palette for fall. I love all the shades. And so I'm just going to take this shade and use my Morphe brush and just pat this all over my crease. Working from the outer V to the inner corner. Next, I'm just going to take this nice bright shade and I'm just going to blend this in circular motions on top of the darker shade that I just applied earlier. And this is just going to blend it out and make it look softer and add a little bit more color to the eyeshadow. And um, just slowly um, take your time to blend it, but do not blend it very much. That will blend out the um, darker color. And for concealer to cut my crease, I'm going to use the uh, ColourPop concealer because it's really thick and I have a bright color. I'll leave the shade down below. And so I'm just going to slowly use my brush to blend out the concealer and starting from the inner corner and work my way outward like in an oval shape. And that's how I normally do my uh, cut creases. So I just slowly take my time because I'm like not that I've been good at doing my cut creases and so um, yeah, I'm still basically learning. <laughs> So I'm just going to pack on the same darker shade I had applied earlier to the outer uh, outer V here and um, so it'll just blend out that concealer that I just applied on. And then I'm also going to take the purple shade in the palette. Uh, I'll leave the name down below as well and pack this on to the area next to the darker shade I just applied and slowly blend it so it mixes together. I definitely love this purple shade in the palette. It's like a plummy, beautiful fall leaf color. And so um, I decided to add it onto the shade because it's just perfect for this eyeshadow look. And this next shade is one of my favorites as well. I don't really have an eyeshadow that's this color and it's called Rose, one of my favorite. It's like a blush. And so um, I'm, I'm pretty sure you also use it as a blush because it's like really nice palette for your face and eyeshadow and so it's really nice and so i use that to also blend out the purple and i definitely loved it next shade I'm going to be using is this mustard yellow shade and I'm just going to apply this on the inner corner of my eye and work it towards the middle where I will blend it with the rose shade and I just think it applied really nice with that color. Next, I'm just going to use this white shade to apply it for my inner corner to add a pop of brightness to the eye and a little bit of blendation to the yellow. Next, I'm just going to use the NYX Cosmetics White Liner and create a line following my crease. And this was just to add a pop of color. I wasn't really a fan of this one because it was like dry, so it made the eyeshadow look a little bit cracked. But then I'm also going to be using the NYX liner as well in the shade black. And this one's perfect for the liquid liner. Mm -hmm. 
So next I'm just gonna apply my mascara by Too Faced and Lashes in the style Splendor. And then I'm just gonna use the same exact shades to blend underneath my eye. And also this green shade for the inner corner to add some color. And next my AOA and my e.l.f. eyeliner for the under eyes. And then the look will be completed. I hope you guys love this fall look and I'll see you next time.